No, it can't be. Uh, leave it to a camera as nice as the Canon PowerShot G7X to let you know that you very desperately need to shave. I did not think it was that bad, and then I watched back the video from yesterday, and I realized that it was in fact that bad. So, here's a clean shave in me, and now we have other problems to discuss. Oh, you guys, I thought, I thought today I was gonna get to go out and do a whole bunch of cool stuff, put it on video, and make a fun video for you guys to watch. But, today has been plagued by many problems. Let me show you the first of one, the, the first of many problems that we have today. That is a nail, and it's in the tire. It's in the tire of the minivan. Don't know when or where I ran over that, but I did. So now my tire is losing pressure at a rate that is worrying. I'm gonna have to get that patched. And I guess I could put the donut on it. And do other people call it a donut? I feel like I'm the only person that calls it a donut. And so I'm gonna have to get my tire replaced, which means I have to get both of them replaced which is gonna be like $200, which in the grand scheme of things isn't that bad, but it's still more money than I want to pay. And then we get to the reason my teeth probably look a little bit more yellow today, and if you were standing here, you'd notice a slight musk. I woke up this morning to my mom telling me that our well pump was broken and we didn't have running water. A quick phone call to Michael and Sons fixed that problem rather quickly. They came out and replaced the well pump. Probably won't look like much. Yeah. Might hear some. Unfortunately, it would appear that replacing the well pump stirred up a lot of sediment in the pipes. We have a problem, which is that all of our pipes or something or other something's wrong and we don't have any water pressure and sometimes the water that comes out of that is this disgusting brown muck you can see that's like that's actually from the hose the plan is to just let we turn the well pump off let the water sit overnight let the sediment settle towards the bottom of the well and hopefully when we turn on the well pump tomorrow, the water will be nice and clear and I'll be able to shower and brush my teeth and make myself presentable. Another cool shirt I found at Target. Look at this, PlayStation. Target, Target's shirt game is on point. Let me tell you that, okay? Target has the best t-shirts. This isn't even a t-shirt. Target has the best shirts. Walmart is trying and they're doing okay, but Target, Target has good shirts. You should go to Target. Oh, what else? What? Uh, I don't even know. Like, there's. Uh, what am I supposed to say? I've been doing this all day. I've been messing with the the well. It's under the rock. I've been messing with the well all day with my dad and Michael and son. I can't go out and get like cool videos of Alexandria or Manassas or DC or anything like that because my tire's flat. So, I. What am I supposed to do? I can't win. I can show you the cat. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. In light of this crisis, however, genius prevails. Let me show you my ingenious method of getting water to at least flush the toilet with. So we've got this dehumidifier running and it's filled up rather well. That's how full it is, and that's when it stops. And it's been running for, it's been running for a couple of hours now, and it seems to be doing rather well for itself. So the dehumid, oop, I'm on manual focus. 
the dehumidifier will be used, the dehumidifier water will be used for toilet water, because that water is not clean. I would not drink it or wash my hands with it or brush my teeth with it. That's gross water. But it makes great toilet water, so that's what it's going to be doing. As some, as some people say, it's a whole thing. And it is a whole thing. In fact, you know what? I'll, I'll start ranting. This entire week has pretty much been a huge disaster. First, our air conditioning stopped working. We had to get a capacitor replaced. Thank God it didn't cost that much. My tire's flat. Everyone in my family was sick earlier this week. Or was it last week? I think it was last week. And my mom had to go to the hospital. It was... And then, what else? I don't even know. Our water, our, our water's all messed up. And yeah, other personal whatever that I don't feel like talking about. Just, it's been a week. And I'm ready for it to stop being a week. And I want things to go back to normal. That would be great. That's all I, that's all, that's all I want. Hopefully that happens here pretty soon. But I'm certain that this video isn't nearly as exciting as one may have thought it would have been uh, upon watching it and clicking on it and doing all that stuff, so... Uh, sorry. I need to grab the trash can. Let's go, let's go on an adventure. We're going to go get the trash can from the end of my driveway. That's our adventure today. In light of all the recent events, I can't say one positive thing. I, I, I almost just fell. I can't say one positive thing. And that's that the weather's been really nice this week. It hasn't been hot. Hasn't really been all that humid. It's been raining a ton, but I don't know. It's not terrible. Look at this. Look at this. See all that orange right there? That's from we had the hose running. But yeah, the low temperatures have been in the 60s and 70s, which is great for me because I can use that to cool off my room overnight. So. As far as the weather's concerned, not really anything to complain about. And then there was the really cool thunderstorm yesterday. This is the stain that the, the pipe that they had to pull out of the well, that's the stain it left on our driveway. Disgusting. Sit back, enjoy the nice peaceful, the nice peaceful creek. Enjoying the nice peaceful creek on the other side. Ah, that's nice and peaceful. Finally mowed the grass down here. We hadn't mowed it in like a month and it looked terrible, but it's all good now. It's all good in the hood, as, uh, as the kids say. Anyway, here's the trash can. I'm gonna. I'm going to take this trash can here and yeet it on up to my house. I think that's what the kids call it. And so I will join back with you tomorrow for another vlog because, believe it or not, this is actually supposed to be a daily vlog and uh, I just haven't been keeping up with it, but I'm going to try to fix that. So thanks for watching. And here, lest you think I'm over, over exaggerating the caliber at which this this horrifying mud is affecting us. These are the filters that we replaced today that are in between the well and the water that comes out of our sink. That is completely freaking disgusting. God, look at that.